And also breaking now, closing arguments happening in the trial of a man accused of killing his wife in their Delaney Park home. David Tronis' lawyers resting their case this morning. And News 6's Jerry Askin is live at the Orange County Courthouse now. And Jerry, we've been waiting to see if the defense would call any witnesses, but that didn't happen. Bridget, from my understanding, no, the defense did not call any witnesses after the prosecution rested its case yesterday. Right now, closing arguments are underway here at the Orange County Courthouse. Uh, we're waiting to see if the jury will begin deliberating at some point today. Let's go ahead and take you all inside the courtroom right now. Uh, David Tron has stayed quiet in court today and held his hands together mostly during closing arguments that began around 1030 this morning. Uh, the prosecution went first. The defense is now presenting its closing arguments at last check. Again, the defense did not present any witnesses and maintains that Tronis is innocent. Prosecutors called more than 20 witnesses. They say Tronis beat and strangled his wife, Shanti Tronis, at their home back in Delaney Park in April of 2018 as their home was undergoing major renovations. Prosecutors told the jury that at one point Tronis wanted their home to go on a home renovation reality TV show, hoping to get their financial pit um, get out the hole, I should say, as far as their finances. Prosecutors saying today in their closing arguments that responding officers and paramedics testified that what they saw on the scene is not consistent with Tronis' story. This isn't an injury consistent with a fall. <clears throat> you heard from Dr. Rutz, the totality of the injuries, even aside from the strangulation, was completely inconsistent with a fall. Yeah, back live here, the defense still presenting its closing arguments. Uh, again, Tron has claimed he found his wife unresponsive in the bath bathtub. He says he's innocent. We're going to keep following this story. Of course, the jury could begin deliberating today. If that happens, we'll let you know. We're live here in downtown Orlando. I'm Jerry Askin, getting results, News 6.